For this video, I had no idea. Welcome to Underwater, the channel to make creators one click at a time. Without any further ado, let's go wander. When studying on YouTube, it's very common to run out of ideas. In fact, according to the Stanford Institute for Economic Policy Research, finding good ideas is becoming harder by the day. The growth rate is the result of two key elements. One, the effective numbers of researchers, and two, the productivity of that research. And what does that mean for YouTube creators without ideas? Well, that means that you have to do a productive research for each and every video. One way to do that is YouTube itself. YouTube tells us exactly what people are looking for. By simply starting typing a keyword within your niche, YouTube will come up with recommendations. Then you can use those recommendations to create your own videos. You need to understand that YouTube is a search engine. People on YouTube are there for them, not for you. So you need to create the type of content that they are looking for. Also, you can optimize these recommendations for better results by using sites and apps. YouTube Trends, Google Trends, and Keywords Everywhere are just a few examples of tools YouTube can offer to help you come up with video ideas. YouTube Trends is the destination for the latest trending videos. By making use of viewership data and aggregating the wisdom of top creators, YouTube Trends analyzes popular videos in real time providing you with real trends developing within the YouTube world. Google Trends will show you how frequently a topic is searched on Google. Also, Google Trends can be used to compare keywords search volume, increasing your chances to come up with idea that you can use for your video topics. And Keywords Everywhere is a premium Chrome extension. They have two versions of this service, a free version and a pay version. The free version shows you related keywords in widgets on the right-hand side of the Google research box, as well as on YouTube. The pay version will show you all of that as well, plus monthly search volume, CPC, and the competition's data. I will leave the link for all of them on the description box below. As a new creator, you don't have the luxury of having the community tab on your channel unless you have 10,000 subscribers or more. But there are other tools you can use instead you can use the pinned comment strategy. All you have to do is engage your audience even more. If they can read your pinned comment, that means that they are commenting on your video. You can say something like this. Welcome to the comment section. Let me know of any specific topic that you in particular would like me to talk about. Then you pin that comment. So it will always be the first comment they see every time they go to the comment section. Another great way to come up with YouTube video ideas is by watching all the YouTubers on the same field as you. This doesn't mean that you are going to replicate what they are doing. During my research for this video, I watched countless videos of creators. And the one thing that they all lack is the numbers behind the reason as to why people run out of ideas. What did I do? I read a few articles about the subject in question and I included in this video the one I consider to be the most relevant. Not to mention that one of them came from Stanford University and other sources. Ravid Rajam, this guy, wrote an article for PGSG and he's saying part that creativity is a skill, not a flash of inspiration. So don't sit down waiting for that big idea. You can get good at what you do if you put in the time and the effort. The link for all those articles are listed on the description box below, so make sure to check it out. And last but not least, you need to take a look at your own channel to see what is working and what isn't. Your YouTube analytics will tell you what type of content you should be creating based completely on data. Paying attention to that fact will help you with new ideas as well as reinforcing the good job that you've been doing. I made a complete video about increasing your CTR. You can check it out by clicking on this card over here. One more fact, and this is completely remarkable. The reason why I made this video is because I had no ideas for today's video, literally. So I decided to take a look at, as to why it happens. And in the process, I discovered something new. Everyone knows that YouTube is a male dominated industry. In fact, an article by Onicore shows that 62% of all of YouTube users are men. And that include creators as well, which outnumber their counterparts by a margin of four to one. But in reality, 
when you type YouTube video ideas on YouTube, it's females giving you ideas. That tells you how important it is to doing your research because you never know what you can discover. Let me know in the comments, where do you get your YouTube video ideas from? And also, do you do a research before you make your videos? Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Activate that notification bell, and I'll see you next time on the water.